Welcome back, everybody. I wanted to take a few moments tonight to speak about Rick Ludwin. Rick was a longtime NBC executive and a friend who passed away last night. We knew him as the vice president in charge of NBC Late Night, and I first met him when I joined SNL in 2001. By then, he was already a legend. His career began at the Mike Douglas show that started in his hometown of Cleveland. He worked with Johnny Carson and Letterman and Conan and Leno and Jimmy, and he was just retiring when we started here on our late night run. But he often came by, gave thoughtfully worded notes that were complimentary, but firm and fair. When I was at SNL, Rick did this old school thing that everybody loved. If you wrote a sketch that did well, he would get a copy of it and write, this played great, Rick, and then send it to you from his office in LA. And it arrived in this strange inner office envelope from a bygone era that when you saw it in your mailbox, you knew before you opened it that it was from Rick. But those pages meant the world to all of us, and we saved them because if you're having a bad week, you had this proof that according to a legend, something you had written that played great. And when someone's sketch would bomb, I mean really bomb, <laughs> in a way that no one could say it had done okay, uh, we would get a page of the script and forge Rick's signature and write this play great and slide it under the door of the writer who wrote it. <laughs> and when I told Rick we had started to do that, he was delighted. <laughs> a very interesting piece of TV history. Uh, Rick was the reason Seinfeld was a show on NBC. When Jerry and Larry David were selling the Seinfeld Chronicles, NBC Primetime wasn't interested, but Rick could see how good it was. So he made a deal that he would take money out of the budget for specials which was his department, and use it to make a season of Seinfeld. And it's unbelievable how one man doing one thing got make a difference in history. Uh, last time I saw him was at Jerry's birthday, uh, which was fitting. Uh, it's also fitting uh, to be talking about Rick uh, on Late Night, because there was nothing Rick liked more than talking about Late Night. And he was so giving and warm with his history and his stories and his time. Uh, there's now a Rick Ludwin studio at his alma mater of Miami University, Ohio. I hope the kids that attend know how lucky they are to even slightly know such a great man. And at his core, uh, the best thing about Rick was how kind he was. Uh, he was kind in a way that was really important uh, to the people he interacted with. He was kind in a way that was very unique uh, for this world uh, that we live in, uh, in, in television and uh, the entertainment industry. And he will just be deeply, deeply missed. I was so lucky to know him. We'll be right back.